What's up, guys? Chris with Chef Sports Cards here. We're doing 2020 Tops Heritage Half Case Break number three. I think I put number four in the title there. I have to fix that, but it is number three. Um, we'll fix that afterwards. So, um, hope everyone's well, staying safe, staying healthy, doing everything everybody's saying you should do. You know, things are we're in some crazy times still, and doesn't seem to be letting up anytime soon. So. Hopefully we can spend some hours here opening cards, have a little entertainment, find some good cards, and, uh, you know, we'll go from there. So uh, I got 9.26 on the clock, so we'll give it a couple minutes, and uh, we'll get rolling. So if you're watching the video, you can jump ahead a few minutes. Otherwise, thanks for joining us tonight, and we'll get going soon. What's up, guys? Chris with Chef Sports Cards here. We're doing 2020 Tops Heritage Half Case Break number three. I know it says number four in the title. Sorry about that. I'll fix that after we're done. Um, all right, so Heritage. Everybody knows their Heritage by now, but a couple quick things before we get going. Um, the Senators' final season cards, if we pull one, goes to the Texas Rangers. Um, dual cards that aren't numbered go to... We go top first, bottom second. So obviously, the Alvarez Aquino rookie being the biggest one out of that. So first one will go to Houston. Second one will go to the Reds. Back and forth and back and forth. Now, if we get one that's numbered or you know parallel some sort, then of course we will uh, you know we'll random it. And then also, if there's any left to right, we do left side first, right side second. Um, if we were to happen to get any non um, baseball autos, which I know are like one in 170,000 packs or whatever it is. Um, I will do a random for it later in the night. Um, just cause I can tell you now I don't have the team set up in random.org. So I just do it on a separate video, uh, after we finish the breaks at the end of the night. So if we happen to hit one, that's how we'll deal with that. Okay. Um, if you're new to the breaks, welcome. Really great. Really appreciate having you. Uh, we always break on Saturday nights. We've been breaking on Saturday nights for about a year and a half now. Uh, we started doing Thursday nights about a month ago, and they're becoming better and better. So I really appreciate it. I, I appreciate you joining. Um, we do ship all cards. We're very generous with the top loading. Um, we top load all the top rookies, uh, which I'm sure everybody knows who they are by now. Lux and Aquino and Alvarez and Bichette and uh, Horner, I think of the five we do. Uh, so we'll, we'll sleeve and top load those before they go out. Obviously any variations, hits, so on and so forth. We also sleeve and top load. If you are new to the channel or haven't had a chance yet, if you can subscribe, be a huge help. We're trying to get our subscribership up, working on it every week. 
I will usually mention it a few times because it's driving me nuts at this point that for like the first year we were around, I never, never th even thought about making pass and people to subscribe. So now I'm trying to push it. So if you can hit that subscribe button, it'd be a huge help. All right. So let's go over the teams real quick. We got a bunch of cards to go through. Uh, Diamondbacks, Tyler N. Braves, John M. Orioles, Scott D. Red Sox, Justin B. Cubs, Blair K. White Sox, Tony Z. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, Reds, Stephen C. Indians, Carl J. Rockies, Richard R. Tigers, Stephen C. Royals, Danny K. Astros, Robert C. Uh, Angels, uh, Bloomstein L. Dodgers, Michael S. Brewers, Scott D. Twins, Kirk M. Marlins, Tim O. Mets, Scott D. Uh, Yankees, Ronald P. Sorry, I can't write, read my own handwriting. Uh, A's, Justin B. Phillies, Timothy H. Pirates, Stephen C. Cardinals, Peter I. Uh, Padres, Michael S. Giants, Jennifer A. Mariners, Michael M. Rays, Tom E. Rangers, Scott D. Blue Jays, David K. And finally, Nationals, Stephen C. All right, guys. So that's about it. If you want to chat, hit the chat. I'm always happy to talk. Uh, if you just want to open some cards, we'll just open some cards. Um, I will usually babble anyway a little bit. But um, that's about it. Let's get to it. Good luck, everyone. Box number one. Now, for those of you who know, we do have a uh, Gypsy Queen, half case of Gypsy Queen tonight at 11. We're going to try to keep that on time. <laughs> um, so, but either way, it'll come up after this. We do take a short break in between the breaks. Short break in between the breaks. Sound a little weird. Um, Tim, what's up, buddy? How you doing? Um, we do take like a five, 10 minute in between, even if we run a little long, just cause I want to get it, you know, get the video uploaded and get reset. I don't have a ton of room here. So, um, you know, it gives everyone a chance to, you know, get a drink, have a pee, whatever. So, all right, let's stop with the box, start with the box topper. Don Kissinger shortstop for the Cubs. Don Kissinger. Steven, how you doing, buddy? All right. All right, let's do it. Good luck, everyone. One, two, three. All right, that Alfaro is a high number short print. Gil, how you doing, bud? And, oh, looks like we have a hot box. Hot box. Uh, Scherzer, purple. So I saw a crazy box in a break last week that had, like, it was ridiculous. It had, like, three hits or four hits and had, like, three uh, action variations and all kinds of nonsense. So let's hope we get one of those tonight. It's so Kettle Marte, purple. It's three. That was my fault, Thomas. Sorry about that, buddy. I'm going to fix it after the break's over. I hit four by accident. Four's on Saturday. So, yeah, you're good. Uh, Dodgers rookies and Arenado purple refractor. So the high numbered short prints are usually in the four hole, um, and that's where I'll check. Like there's a high number of Raldus Chapman, um, uh, Xander Bogarts high numbered. I'm sure I'll find a few more in the sort, but if we sit here and try to go through the backs on everything, we'll be here all night. So, uh, 
unless I see, you know, I specifically see one. So usually like the four, the high number or the insert or whatever sitting as the fourth card. So uh, we'll, we'll check those throughout the night. And then when we do the sword, I'll double check them. Uh, Orioles, purple. Right. Let's see what we can do, Tim. <laughs> All right, Gavin Lux, the Gavin Lux action variation for the Dodgers. Congrats to the Dodgers. Nice hit. And Josh Bell for the Pirates. Good start for the Dodgers. Give me a second here. I gotta get my piles situated. <laughs> Especially now that we got these, uh, got this hot box. That's what's throwing me off. The, another pile. <laughs> All right, action. Purple. High number. And box stoppers. We'll put up there. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, twins rookies. It's uh, D Gordon, high numbered, and Charlie Morton for the Rays. And Matt Olson for the A's. Solar for the Royals. Rangers rookies. Uh, Devers for the Sox. Uh, Cole Calhoun, high numbered, and Mike Clevenger for the Indians, purple. Now, if any of you don't know, because I didn't say it, the purples aren't numbered. Uh, I'm sure you guys all know this, but uh, they are hot box refractors, so they're pretty limited. Uh, usually one hot box to a case. Oh, geez. Tough guy pack. Um, I actually did see a case with two hot boxes, so. I, I think it's possible, rare, but possible. So we'll see. And Brian Reynolds for the Pirates. And Max Fried for the Braves. Sonny Gray, high numbered for the Reds, and Chris Paddock for the Padres. And Acuna for the Braves. Nice one for the Braves. Coming here for the Nationals, Sean Doolittle, 
white border, which white borders are to 50 copies. They're, they're not numbered, but uh, there are 50 copies. So nice one for Stephen C. And a springer behind that. <clears throat> Yo, Tim, it's funny. I um, I was wondering if I was going to see you tonight. I don't mind my voice. I don't know why it's not uh, working. Well, let me get a drink. Um, I was in an NT break last week. And I got the uh, one of one Miles Sanders out of it. And I was hoping to have it by today to put it up here to show you. But I didn't get it in yet. I thought I was going to get it today. But I guess tomorrow. Nice one for the Nets. All right. We're still looking for our hit and still getting all these beautiful purple refractors. Jerickson Profar. Not high numbered. Okay. There's a Pete Alonzo cup card with purple for the Mets. Nice one there. Yeah, I'll um, I'll put it up on Saturday. I should have it tomorrow. I'll put I'll bring it up so I can show it to you. It's pretty cool. I um, here's a Lariano high number for the A's and Giolito. <clears throat> so I don't buy into many football breaks. I'm a football fan, but I'm not really a collector. But I always buy into an NT break when it comes out by the Eagles and one in the attempt of always trying to get a Carson Wentz auto. Which at this point I should probably just buy one. Uh, because of the money I've spent, but uh, I bought into one and uh, get that Miles Sanders one of one, so it was nice. Yastrzemski for the Giants. So I'm not complaining. I also hit a second one too out of the same break, a second RPA. So uh, it was it was really good to me. Bijo, there is a Bobochet rookie and a second Acuna. Oh, and we have a jeez, uh, we got all kinds of nonsense going on in here. Okay, so we got the Bobochet rookie. We got a second Acuna purple, and we have a redemption, which I have no idea. Clubhouse collection dual autograph relic. Here we go, guys. Good luck, Mike Trout, Shohei Otani. Who has the Angels? Oh, my. Wow. Nice hit. Bloomstein Lee. Wow. <laughs> Trout Otani. Dual Relic Auto. Woo. It's been a good box, boys. Can't complain. <laughs> Those are not easy ones to pull. Congrats, congrats, congrats. It's a monster. Kirk, glad to have you, buddy. Woo, nice hit for the Angels. Congrats, buddy. That is not one you will find every day, my friend. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> All right, good start, good start, good start. Let's keep it up. It's funny, too, because I was looking at, like, I don't even know what is a redemption in here. So, uh, Syndergaard hide number for the Mets. And J.D. Davis for the Mets. All right, a couple packs left in box one. A hot box. You missed the hit? It was a redemption, but that was the hit. Dual Relic Auto, Trout Otani. I wish it was live. I would love to see that. Oh, my God. Gavin Lux again. The Dodgers. Nice. Rookie. That's a nice box, man. West Coast is killing it in this box. <laughs> Nice Gavin Lux purple. I hope uh, I hope our Angels guy is here. I don't really recognize the name. He's a he's a new guy. 
or newer. I just don't recognize it. All right, so we got Michael Brantley for the Astros to nine ninety nine for Robert C. And then behind that, we also have a Carlos Correa purple. Nice. And another Gavin Lux. Jeez. <laughs> so we've had a Gavin Lux base, Gavin Lux purple, and a Gavin Lux action all in this box. On top of the uh, Otani and uh, Trout. And it's a hot box. Nice Michael Brantley also. Congrats. All right, last pack. Who knows? Let's see if there's something in here. <laughs> this box. I'm, a, I'm, I'm worried about where we're going from here. Uh, it's a Jason Hayward, high number. And, yeah, just to top it off, how about a Tatis purple to go with everything else? Oh, yeah, Tim? This is my man. He's right here. <laughs> Trout's always with us. Every break. He's never missed a break yet. So, well, guys, I that first box was mind-numbing. Let's hope it keeps out going that way. Uh, good luck, box two. Jeez. That was something else. All right, box topper, super baseball. He seems like it. He really does. And there's a Otani box topper just to go along with, uh, you know, the other Otani. Because the Angels haven't gotten enough yet. <laughs> just teasing. <laughs> I just want everyone to get a hit like that, you know. All right, let's get going. Uh, Theus rookie. Yeah, I like I said, there's nothing about Mike Trout that doesn't seem like he's a good dude. You know, and honestly, I could not necessarily say that if I had that kind of talent, you know, and ability that. You know, I might not be a dick, <laughs> for lack of a better term. Oh, sorry. Trying to keep it PG. Sorry about that. Um, but, you know, a guy like that could be very uh, the other way, too. You know, there's been a lot of them over the years. There's a Ben Attendee high number for the Sox. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I think some guys are just made to love this, love sports they play, you know. And uh, he seems like one of them, you know. Tucker Barnhart. No. Nice. I I'm so glad you're here and you got to see that, man. Seriously. Congrats, buddy. That is awesome. Blackman high number for the Rockies. Uh, Bregman for the Astros. Kikuchi high number for the Mariners.
<laughs> I think we all PC trout. <laughs> That's the way I kind of look at it. I have not had a lot of luck in my life, though, with trouts, to be honest with you. In the almost 10 years that I've been back in collecting, uh, well, I pulled one last month, so I should not be complaining. There is a Willie Mays in action. 20 giant seasons. Wow. I don't even know what this card is. But it looks pretty awesome. I mean, it's obviously a buyback. I'm assuming a 71 Willie Mays, but who? Very sweet for the Giants. Congrats, man. We might be onto something in this case. I don't know. Yeah, I like I said, I did I pulled one for myself last month, but before that, I think I've only pulled two. This would be, well, this is the first one in a break that I've pulled, to be honest with you. Um but and I know other guys too pull them all the time, so I don't know. Sweet hit for the Giants, man. Jennifer A, congrats. I, I, you have to research that one a little bit. I don't even really know what's going on with that one, but obviously it's a, it's a seventy-one buyback, but very cool. Um, I own my own company, so um, I used to, um, I used to work in a lot of high-end places, especially steakhouses. I worked for. Um, Sullivan's and Del Frisco's for like 15 years. Uh, Yasmani Grandal high numbered. Um, I worked for Morton's too for a couple years before I went to them, but now I own my own company. I have a, um, I have nine cafes that are in office buildings throughout the suburbs of Philadelphia. One in 8,000 packs, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Jesus. I, I mean, I knew it was a 72 buyback, but that, that is sick, right? It's funny because I was just, I have a, you guys are going to laugh at me. I have a cheat sheet over here. See my cheat sheet? I wrote this up when it first, when the thing first came out. I try to have as much information as I can. And I was looking at my cheat sheet like, wow, this isn't on there. <laughs> so very cool. Congrats to the Giants. Let's keep it up. Flashback. Mankind explores a red planet. Nice. There's another Gavin Lux rookie. And here, whoa, <laughs> Jesus, what are we on to in this case? Although Hank's getting a little old to be signing anymore, man. That 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 uh, auto is uh, rough. For the Braves, John M. Hank Aaron's autograph. Beautiful, man. Wow. Jeez, we're on to something in this case, man. So let's see. We've got a Hank Aaron, a Trout and a Tani auto in two boxes. Damn, man. Nice one for the Braves. Congrats. Man, it's a shame, though, they have Hank still signing. I mean, obviously, he's getting a little old to be signing, but hey. Hank Aaron Auto is a Hank Aaron Auto, man. I, I'm not complaining, believe me. Congratulations to the Braves, man. That is awesome. Uh, Rizzo, no. Is that Alex Gordon high number? <laughs> Congrats, John. Dude, I can't stop dancing either, man. I am so happy for you. This is awesome. And another Gavin Lux rookie. My God almighty. Gavin Lux rookie's falling from the sky.
It's another Boba Shett rookie. Yeah, tell me about it. Let's let's hope it stays this way. You know how it is though. Sometimes that's a Jeff McNeil high number. Um, you know, you get these crazy cases sometimes. Let's hope that's what we're on to here, man. Where it's like every single, you know, every single box has like one crazy thing after another. So what I'm going to do is, um, after I finish this box, I'm going to put this base, I'm going to scan the backs just real quick to see if there's any, um, if we have any French backs. Um, in the box up the base that we have so far, and then we'll move on. Just take me a second to scan them real quick. There's a Kyle Hendricks high number for the Cubs. <laughs> well, boys, remember where you saw it. <laughs> Uh, I wish I got him like this all the time. <laughs> Although, I'll tell you what, I mean, all year, I can't, and a lot of the regulars, I mean, some obviously are here now, but uh, a lot of the regulars are here on um, Saturday nights, and I'll tell you what, we haven't had too many duds this year. I mean, we haven't had a lot of cases where we're pulling Trout and uh, Hank Aaron's out of them, but... Um, you know, we've been having a pretty good run all year. Series 1 was really nice to us. Uh, there's a Carlos Martinez high number. Bowman's best was really good to us. Um, we did like, I don't know, 8 or 10 cases of Bowman's best. I don't think we had a single dud out of those. Yeah, that's true. Uh, Yamamoto rookie. All right, give me one minute to just put this base away and scan the backs real quick for any yellow guys. <laughs> yeah those hot boxes can be real hit and miss too like sometimes you get a hot box and it's like you don't get one you know single rookie or superstar or anything out of it and it's I mean, they're cool and everything, but you're like, Jesus Christ, <laughs> you know, out of, tw you know, out of 24 packs or whatever it is, you think you could get something, you know? All right, no yellow backs in those first two. Not that I'm complaining about those first two boxes <laughs> in any way, shape, or form. Leave a couple. Yeah. <laughs> if you're just getting here, start over. Let's say that. <laughs> Go back to the beginning and watch. Because uh, 
you know, let's hope the other four boxes go the way those two did. Although, like I said, man, you get those sometimes, you know what I mean? Where it's like, you know, you get a whole case where it's just like one thing after another, you know, you're like, holy mother. <laughs> and then you think about all the boxes you've opened that had absolutely nothing in it. And you think, Jesus, why couldn't they throw one of these in there? You know? Oh, uh, my little guy out of here. All right, we got a buyback for the box topper. Piles are nice. All right, here we go. Box three. Good luck, everyone. Louis Taint. Is that guy's name Taint? <laughs> For the twins. Uh, 71 buyback for the twinnies. Uh, make sure I got my uh, over here. All right, there's that that guy. All right, here we go. Uh, Cardinals rookies. That is the guy's name, right? <laughs> Am I wrong about that? Or is that guy's name Taint? I don't know if you need the I, but... Smith. There is a Victor Robles high number for Washington. And another Bichette rookie. I believe that's number two or three. Taunt. Taunt. T -t -aunt. Okay. Well, I, you know, I don't know the guy, so it's going on what I saw. <laughs> Luis Tiant. Tiant. Luis Tiant. He was probably the other way, and he started playing in America, and he was like, everyone was like, you better change your name, bud. <laughs> All right, let's look for another monster. Jose Leclerc, high number four, Texas. Intel changes the future of computing. <laughs> Those non-baseball uh, cards, I just kind of randomly give them out. So if you find one in your pack, you know why. Come on, focus. Hey, hey, hey. There is an Aquino action. Rookie. Congrats to the Reds. Uh, Stephen C. Nice Aquino action. Congrats. <laughs> Uh, all right. 
Sorry, let me uh, fix a couple cards here real quick. A couple uh, top loaders I need. All right, guys. Pressing on. Good luck. Now, we are going to do... Um, we are going to do the second half of this case on Saturday night. Just, you know, throwing it out there. Um, second half of, oh, here's a Mike Trout high number for the Angels. Um, second half of this and the second half of the Gypsy Queen case, half case we're doing tonight, we're doing on Saturday also. So if anyone's interested, we'd love to have you. Jake Rogers rookie and there is our first Jordan Aquino rookie that one will go to Houston and then the next one will go to the Reds That's one I don't quite understand why they felt the need to put these two on the same card. <clears throat> I mean, I suppose a uh, hundred years from now, if they're both Hall of Famers, it'll be, you know, something quite special to have. But they should think of us breakers out there. <laughs> All right, here we go. We got a refractor coming up of Verlander for the Astros. Another one for the Houston to $9.99. See if we can see it. Four, $4.43 of $9.99. See? So I'm sure everyone's had projects going on since everyone's stuck in the house. For the last two days, I've been going through boxes of cards and just dumping base cards. <laughs> I don't know how I ended up with so many boxes full of base cards. Uh, of, ugh, God, crap, most of it. Um, Walker Bueller high number for the Dodgers. So for two days, I've been working on cleaning out boxes of uh, cards and going through them and pulling rookies and pulling stuff I want to keep and tossing stuff I don't want to keep. And, you know, a lot of it, like I said, just being, you know, like vet base and stuff like that from, you know, eight years ago or whatever, you know. But I've, uh, my trash men are not going to be happy tomorrow when they pull up. <laughs> All right, we got a hit coming up. Good luck, everyone. For San Diego, Chris Apatic, Jersey Relic, not numbered. <laughs> uh, one second, guys. Uh, actually, I can use this one. Uh, San Diego, Michael S. Chris Paddock. Yeah, I mean, I, <laughs> you know, I, I did keep some for that, but when I tell you I have emptied seven 5,000 card boxes so far. So what's that? 35,000 cards have emptied. So... It's one of those things like I know if I don't just get rid of it, they're still going to sit here forever. 
And I'm sure Robbie Ray for the Diamondback high, Diamondbacks high number. I'm sure there's something in there I'm tossing that's, you know, three months from now you'll be like, damn, why did I throw that away? But sometimes you just gotta pull off the pull off the band-aid, you know. Yeah, I mean, I'm the same way. I've probably been through a hundred thousand cards in the last two days and have a long way to go still. Rice Rice Hoskins, high number. Um just kind of glad to get to the breaks because it'll pull me away from it for a few days. <laughs> you know, I probably won't get back to it till Monday because I'll, you know, tomorrow and I'll do this sort and everything. And but it's been good. It's 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 a good thing to do. Otherwise, they just keep piling up. You know. And like I said, I'm sure there's some place I could use them, but or will want them at some point. But if you don't do it, sometimes, man, it gets really out of hand. Uh, San Diaz, rookie. Sam Hilliard, rookie on the back. And honestly, when are you going to get a better time to do it? <laughs> you know, because if you try to do it on the weekends with the amount of cards like someone like John has or I have, or I'm sure a lot of you have, you know, um, it'll take you weeks to get it done, you know. Brendan McKay, rookie on the back. Uh, Tim Anderson, high number for the White Sox. Uh, no. Yep. See what I can do, Tim. <laughs> nope. Here's a uh, Stanton high number for the Yanks. All right, it's the end of box three. You know, what? I'll just I'm gonna do the quick French back scan real quick on this one. I would love to tell you I have a great system. I do not. I really don't. Um, I mean, how I organize hits and stuff uh, is much different than everything else that I hold on to. Um, hits I do I do by uh, product. Um, I know some people do them by numbers. Some people do them by players. Some people, yeah, it depends on what your collection is too. You know. Um, I don't have a, a ton of, like, you know, I only PC one guy and then it's, you know, I collect a bunch of other stuff. So I do everything like all my Bowman autos are with all my Bowman autos and so on and so forth, you know. Yeah, you're better than I am, John. You're definitely better than I am. <laughs> Uh, baseball greatest moments box topper. All right, this is a box number four. Good luck, everyone. See what we got for the box topper. Brooks ties Ruth's record. Nice Brooks Robinson for the Orioles. I don't even know where I'd put those, all those binders. <laughs> God, I wish. Oh, God. You must have some space, my man. Uh, there's a Charlie Morton, high numbered. And our second 
uh, Jordan, a rookie. That one going to the Reds. But so like anything that's like, you know, quote unquote, a hit relic auto, you know, patch, patch auto, whatever it is, they're all divided out by in mine by um, type Bowman Chrome, Bowman Platinum, Topps Chrome, so on and so forth like that. It's probably a terrible way to do it, but it's just what I've done and I'm used to it, you know. There is a Shohei Otani high numbered action. Jesus. The Angels are having a hell of a, a hell of a break. Is a high number action short print of Otani. Congrats, buddy. I do too. Unfortunately, the room's not very big. <laughs> I'm in it right now <laughs> doing this. That's why it's well, and I share it kind of with my son. My son's uh, sneaker collection is in here. So, uh, and I have this whole setup, like basically a studio set up in here to do breaks and stuff. So uh, I don't have near as much room as I'd like. There's a lot of 5,000 card boxes in here. <laughs> This is also the only room I find that the um, temperature and humidity is halfway decent. Um, I keep like a, I keep it regulated a little bit, you know, with the dehumidifier and stuff like that. I, I, when I was first collected again, I was stored in a few different places in my house, in my basement and stuff, and the cards got trashed. Uh, the humidity was way too high. They stuck together. They bent. They did all kinds of things. So... For the Giants, Gianni Cueto, white border. It's 50 copies there. Congrats to the Giants. Another nice one, Jennifer A. To go along with that uh, buyback. That's 71 buyback of um, Willie Mays. That was crazy. Nice one for the Giants. Yeah, so I, one of the problems I found was I just didn't have a good temperature-wise spot to keep them at first. Rangers rookies. Jonathan Villar, high-numbered for Miami. Um, so this is like a, a third bedroom in our house that I turned into this. And then, like I said, it was... It was a smaller room, so it was easier to put like a dehumidifier and have it work well in here rather than trying to put one in my basement and stuff like that. So, come on, focus. For the Mets, nice um, chrome of Jeff McNeil, high number to 999, 317 of 999 for the Mets. Uh, Scott D, congrats, buddy. It's a good one. I like Jeff McNeil. He's a, he seems like a guy who could be a good player for long term. All right. Uh, uh, J.D. Davis, high numbered for the Mets. 
Giants rookies. Correa on the back. And the only problem is in this room sometimes it's a little dry. <laughs> Juan Soto, high number for the Nationals. Joey Gallo, no. I thought that was his high number. Hit coming up. Oh, oh, wow. This case for the Braves. Jeez. Hank Aaron, Ronald Acuna, dual relic, hand number 39 of 71. Jesus. Clubhouse collection, dual relic card. So the. Wasn't the Otani Clubhouse Collection dual autograph relic, so it'd be kind of similar. Jeez, the Braves, John, man, you're having a hell of a break, too. Wow. Congrats, buddy. That is a cool ass. I'm sorry, cool card. Very cool card. Wow. I like that one a lot. Let's see if I have the right size time loader here for it. I'm going to have to go get one. Very, very cool. Congrats, man. Because, you know, the Hank Aaron autograph wasn't enough. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> wow. Uh, Mike Yastrzemski, high number for the Giants. Yeah, Braves, Dodger, Angels. We have a lot of good teams come out of this one. Here's our first Nico rookie. Happy birthday, man! I hope I'm I hope I'm uh, fulfilling your birthday wishes here. <laughs> Jacob the Grom high number for the Mets. So like these guys here, same deal. Whoops. Same deal. First one will go to, you know, the top. Second one will go to the guys on the bottom. So just so you know. All right, hold on a second here. Uh, 
All right, last few packs of box four. <laughs> I will, man. Let's keep pulling them. Escobar, high number for the D-backs. <laughs> Giolito high number for the White Sox. Organizing here before we go to box number five. I'm just checking for yellow backs real quick again. One box is easier to do than two. No yellow backs. Okay. Box number five. Good luck, everyone. Let's keep it up. All right. There's 71 buyback. For the Mets, Wayne Garrett. All right. Nice buyback for the Mets. All right, box five. Good luck, everyone. Disney East Coast. There is our third uh, Jordan and Aquino. And so that one will go to Houston. Go. 
Yep. Shane Bieber high number for the Indians. Is a Michael Chavez high number. He's actually number 500. I didn't even realize that for the Red Sox. There is a, a Tatis. Okay, what do we got here? I can't even see it on there. <laughs> I'm so blind sometimes. Silver, that's what it is. Jeez, I'm looking at it like, wait a second. All right, Fernando Tatis Jr., silver for the Padres. This is, what are they, one in 265, but nice one for the Padres. High number, silver team name variation. Congrats. Michael S., congrats, buddy. Sometimes it's staring you right in the face. You just can't say it. <laughs> I'm like, I know what this is. Why am I not seeing it? <clears throat> nice, Tatis. Congrats, bud. Hitch, just keep on rolling. Matt Chapman, high number for the A's. Uh, Christian Walker, high number for the Diamondbacks. There's another Nico. 
think that's our second Nico. All right, another hit coming up. Good luck, everyone. Come on. For Texas, Elvis Anders. Jersey Relic, not numbered. Sneaky Texas hit for Scott D. David Dahl, high number for the Rockies. Another chrome coming up. For the Indians, Carlos Santana, numbered 372 of 999. For the Indo Indians, Carl J. Congrats, buddy. Miguel Sano, high number for the Twins. Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> it's funny. <fun. laughs> Robert, it's funny you say that. I was just thinking exactly the same thing. I've actually, um, I am blessed with the fact that I have a uh, card shop in my town. Um, it's not the best card shop in the world. It's, it's more memorabilia than it is cards, but I've always been lucky because I've had some place to run to if I'm like low on top loaders or something like that, you know, because usually I order them online and order cases of them and sometimes I forget or uh, don't order them in time. Uh, Hunter Renfro, high number for the Rays. Um, so I can always run there and pick up like 100 or whatever. So I've been very, very specific, like going out of my way to over order. I literally have like a bookshelf full of top loaders here in every which size I spent like just because of this recent crisis, I didn't know if I was going to be able to get them. So I knew I wasn't going to be able to get them from the local shop because they're closed. So I was like, I better bring in tons of top loaders because <clears throat> sometimes I buy them and think like, oh, I got enough. And then I start, you know, doing the 
putting the breaks together and realize I don't. So, all right, last pack of box five. Good luck, everybody. Giovanni Gallegos, Gallegos for the Cardinals high number. All right, let's get into box six, and then I'll check the last two uh, for yellowbacks after we do this one. And we're going to do, so we'll do a, a hit recap, obviously, at the end. Who would not want to see a hit recap of this? <laughs> um and we will, you know, take a break in between. I would say most likely um, Gypsy Queen's probably going to start at like 10 after 11, 11, 15, like around there. There's a Vlad box stopper for Toronto. And we'll see how quickly we get through this one. All right. Good luck, everybody. You know what? These guys up here helps with the focus. All right. Nope. For the Cubs, Anthony Rizzo to 50. Congrats, white border Anthony Rizzo. Uh, Blair Kay. Come on, focus. There it goes. Nice one. Nice one for the Cubs. Congrats. I do have a tendency to go through a lot of top loaders. I don't mind, though, to be honest with you. I, uh, well, why is my focus all screwed up now? Come on, focus. Honestly, I always figured... Jesus Christ. Hold on. I always figure spending a few extra dollars on top loaders is definitely better than having a problem with a card, you know? Because that'll cost you a lot more in the long run anyway. Uh, Chris Sale, high number for the Red Sox. All right, let's see if we can pull one more monster out of this box. Not that we haven't pulled a handful of them already. Matt Theus, rookie. AJ Pollock high number for the Dodgers. Come on, focus.
There's a uh, Devers action variation for the Red Sox. Congrats to the Sox. Justin B. Nice one for the Red Sox. Congrats. There is a high numbered Eloy for the White Sox. Alex Bregman, high number for Houston. Is that Collins rookie? Looks like our next hit's coming up for the Angels. <laughs> uh, Clubhouse Collection Relic, Albert Pujols, a little bat relic there, not numbered. Congrats to the Angels. Nice one. Another one for the Angels. Ooh. A lot of teams make out well in this one. Corey Seager, high number for the Dodgers. You're welcome, buddy. Uh, Liam Hendricks, high number for the A's. Um, sure, a bunch of teams have done really well out of this half case. Angels, Braves. <laughs> There's another Gavin Lux rookie. Um, Dodgers, Padres. They've all done pretty well. So it's been spread around a little bit, which is good, but definitely some monsters in this one. And like I said, second half is on Saturday night. We can only hope it keeps going throughout the case. So if you'd like to join us, we'd love to have you. And again, guys, if you haven't, I know I say it all the time, if you haven't subscribed to the page, if you could hit the subscribe button, it'd be a huge help. Just trying to get those numbers up. Paul DeJong, high number four, the Cardinals. 
If I haven't earned it tonight, I don't know when I will. <laughs> There's a third Nico rookie. <clears throat> All right, two more packs here. All right, guys, so I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to check these two boxes for yellow backs, for any uh, French backs, and then do the hit recap. And if anyone is hanging around or showing up for Gypsy Queen, let's look at Gypsy Queen for 11.15 is going to be our start time. Give me a chance to go off and get set up. Hey, 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 <laughs> Tim, in the very last pack, Andrew McCutcheon, high numbered short print for the Phillies. There you go, buddy. <laughs> All right, let me check these real quick. <laughs> ask and you shall receive I'll tell you what man there is something with the card gods when you ask for something it's amazing how often they come out you know you're welcome buddy I'm glad I could help Still just checking the backs these last two boxes, see if there are any, any uh, yellow backs in here. Mm, nothing so far. I'm surprised. I thought we'd have one in this half, but I, I'm, I'm certainly not complaining. <laughs> Again, guys, if I do come across something in the sort, because it's not, it doesn't happen often, but certainly with a product like Heritage, there is always things you can miss sometimes. Uh, not only will you receive it, obviously, but I will send you an email and let you know about it, too. Um, you know, we don't miss stuff too often, but with a product like Heritage, there's certainly uh, sometimes things to be found, you know. All right, last stack. All right, no, uh, no yellow backs in there. Okay, let me get this hit recap together and we will be out of here. Again, guys, if anyone's showing up for Gypsy Queen, we are going to start at 11.15 for Gypsy Queen. We had this monster half case of Heritage ran. It's just a little long. Uh, so if you want to hang out, if you want to come back, it's up to you. All right. So these are all our high numbered short prints there. We're not going to go through all that nonsense, but just so you can see. This is a, there's so much stuff here. This one's a little difficult. <laughs> uh, action. Let's get a 
things here. Action. Action. Queen. Okay, all of our purples. Okay, where to start? Let's see. Let's get some rookies together all right guys so here all are let's bring the camera up a little bit here all our uh high numbered short prints we're not going to go through all those here are all the purples, which we had some really nice ones in there. Two Acunas and Alonzo, uh, Tatis, so on and so forth. Okay. Our rookies, uh, Gavin Lux. Well, kind of got screwed up there. One, two, three, four regular. And we had a purple Gavin Lux, which is awesome. Uh, Bichette, one, two, three. These again will be uh, sleeved and top loaded. Uh, Jordan and Aquino, one, two, three. So two will go to Houston, one will go to uh, Cincinnati, and one, two, three on the Nikos. Okay. So those were all of our rooks. Um, box toppers. So you can see them real quick. We had this Don Kissinger, Otani, uh, Luis Tiant, and then Brooks Robinson, Wayne Garrett, and Vlad. Those were all the box toppers that came out of them. <clears throat> Numbered um, Brantley to $9.99, McNeil to $9.99. Verlander to $9.99 and Santana to $9.99. And then white bordered, which are 50 copies, not numbered, but 50 copies. Cueto for the Giants, Doolittle for the Nationals, Rizzo for the Cubs. Now, let's get into some meat and potatoes here. Because there was some definite meat and potatoes here. <laughs> we got a Willie Mays um, buyback, 71 buyback, which... I was told by the other guys in the break, it's like one in 8,000 packs. Monster hit for San Francisco. Congrats. We got a silver name uh, plate, Tatis, high number Tatis. Congrats there. Red Sox, uh, Devers, action. Otani, action. Aquino, action. And Gavin Lux, action short prints. So a lot of nice action short prints there. Uh, hits. <laughs> I don't even know what order to show them in, to be honest with you. All right, well, let's start with these three. So we had these three clubhouse relics. One was Chris Paddock, Elvis Anders, and Pujols. And then we had these three guys here. We had a dual um, relic, hand number to 71, Hank Aaron and Ronald Acuna, which is a monster. Then we had this nice Hank Aaron auto, another monster. And then finally, we had this dual 
Redemption autograph of Mike Trout and Otani. So, needless to say, it's the best half of Heritage I've ever laid eyes on. <laughs> and we got another half on Saturday night. So, guys, I really hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed opening it. It was a ton of fun. You guys are great guys to open it for. We will have this out to you probably tomorrow by the latest on Saturday morning. If you're coming in for Gypsy Queen, we're going to start in about 15 minutes. So, uh, take a break, get a drink, whatever, and jump back in. And I'll be back on in about 10 minutes, and we'll be ready to roll. Thanks a lot, guys. I really enjoyed it. Take care.